Hello everyone and welcome back to Zuzi Zany World. As you know when we left off last I was building this lovely flamingo and I didn't get to finish his head so that's what we're gonna do right now.
can't remember when I, what all I told you guys about the greater flamingos. They live in fresh waters. They eat microscopic animals from like the mud and water and their beak actually they filter out so they just suck up a bunch of water and mud and then just filter out a bunch of animals well microscopic animals okay I'm sorry well not microscopic animals like small organisms I'm sorry I'm just using the word wrong um, yeah, their bent bills are what allows them to eat such organisms, which I think is awesome. And I think I told you the reason they're pink is from their food. Yeah, he's looking awesome. Oh, the, um, Great greater flamingo is actually a larger slice than the other flamingos, so it allows it to wade in deeper waters than most flamingos. And they use their long legs to stir up their water and mud to eat it to get all those organisms that they eat. And I think that's everything that I wanted to tell you guys about. Them. Oh, and they can travel up to 300 miles to find food. And they, um, any of them that live outside of the tropics do migrate to warmer weather during the winter. But here's our little flamingo guy. I will be putting a item frame with a black piece of wool there to fill in his eye and of course I'm going to fill in the other side because I know he's completely naked on the other side I just didn't want to do that in a video because building the entire thing is going to take ages but I'll show you guys in the next video what he turns out to be completely thank you all for watching and you have a great day bye Okay, so I lied to you. I'm going to show you the completed flamingo. This is what he looks like. I added a little bit of black to the tip of his wings because some flamingos do have little black on their wings. And I changed where the walkway went because it was going like right under his neck. So, actually, um... My Dracula friend told me to extend the water out so it looked like he was eating and put a little bridge for the walkway so that's what this is here a little bridge to go over the walkway and then I asked my friends what we should name him and his name is Boris so everybody welcome Boris hello Boris Oh yes, and see, he does have eyes now, so he can see this vast land. Oh, and nobody has adopted him, which is, I, I find so sad. 
Maybe, maybe I'll adopt him. <clears throat> Thank you again for watching and have a great day. And I will see you next time. Bye.